Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today we are going to do stock transfer order between plants with batch management in SAP MM S4. So what is the step is, create, I'm going to create a material in MM01, I'm going to create a batch in MSE1 and extend the material to other plant in MM01. Create purchase order, create goods result, do invoice certification and do Transfer posting in MIGO transaction, this final one with batch finish. This final one with batch finish. Okay, now, so the, there are two step, two procedures, one step procedure and two step procedure. One step procedure is movement type with 301 and our two step procedure is movement type 301 and 305. 303 and 305 is stock and transit. It pick, when, when I use 303, it pick up stock and transit and 305, I receive the material with the batch. And the plant is MA0, MA03. This plant is MA03, MA03 to SU01 plant. Now let's get into the. If you want to know how to create a plant, a link has been provided in the description. How to create a plant? Check the link. Now let's get into the MM01 transaction code MM01. This is mechanical engineering. Select. Z raw material. What do you use raw material? This is this one raw material. Press enter. Enter. Now MA03 is my plant. Storage location MA03 is my storage location. Press enter. Batch managed material each. Enter material group. Press enter, enter, select batch management here. Press enter, enter, no MRP, ND is no MRP. Material requirement planning, no material requirement. Press enter, enter, enter. Finally, valuation class is 3000. 3000 is my valuation class. Let me take, take this material, enter and let me save this. Now, I'm going to extend the material to SU01. The same material, I'm going to extend, extend it to SU01 plant. Press enter. SU01 is my plant. SU01 is my storage location. Let me extend it. ND, no MR. 3000 is my valuation plus. And save. Now I have just ex extended it. Now let me create ME21N. I'm going to create purchase order and goods result and invoice. Let me enter 1468 is my supplier. Purchase organization is MA01. It's my purchase organization. Purchasing group. Let me enter the material here. This is my material. Quantity is, let me enter 50 quantity. My plant is MA03. Net price 1100. Go to the right and MA03. It's my storage location and save. Save. This is my PO. Let me take a note of this PO. Let me take this PO and I'm going to do goods reserved. Go to slash and MIG. Before that, I'm going to create a batch. Let me create a batch. I'm going to assign the batch here. Slash and MSC 1N. 1N. MSC 1N transaction code. Enter the plan. MA03. Storage location MA03. Press enter. OK. Click on to OK. I'm going to select date of manufacture, 1st of July. Shelf life expiry date, October, 1st of October. Available from date, 10th of July. And let me save this. Now all the attributes, shelf life expiry date, date of manufacture and available from date, all the three attributes are assigned to this batch. 
this batch. Assign to this batch. Now let's go to Migo slash and MI2. Enter purchase order number here. Press enter. Click on two. Scroll down. Go to purchase order data. Quantity material. Batch. Select the batch here. Select the batch here. Come back. Batch by for plant material. Press enter. This is the batch which I have created it now. Now item OK and post. I've just posted it. Now let's go to MMBE and check. Go to inventory. MMBE and le let me check the inventory. Let me delete this. Delete this plant, storage location, batch, everything, and let me execute this. See 15, 482 batch, 50 quantities there. Now I'm going to transfer and I'm going to do invoice certification also. Go to slash and MIRO. I'll do invoice certification for this. GB10. Enter invoice date. Calculate tax, enter purchase order number here. Six four this amount, six four nine double zero. Six four nine double zero. Enter base time date and save it and save it. Now let me do transfer posting slash and MI G. One step procedure. We'll do this step. One step procedure. This step. Three not one. Go to transfer, select transfer posting, transfer posting, other 301, see 301, 10 material I'm going to transfer it, material this is not this material, this is my material, this is my material, let me enter this material, enter plan, MA03 is my plan. Storage location MA03. Destination SU01. Press enter. SU01 is my storage location. Plant and storage location. Now go to quantity. 10 quantity. Let me select the batch here. See here. Now I'm going to select the batch here. Transfer posting batch. Same batch I'm going to use it. Or I'm going to use my own batch, triple zero four five two. Press enter. I'm going to use my own batch. Or we can create another one more batch here. You can create another one one more batch in MSC one end. Slash in MSC one end. MSC one end. I'm going to create another one more batch. Okay, date of manufacture, everything same. Now save it. 483 is my batch. Now let me enter 483. The same batch here. Enter the batch here. Press enter. And post. Post. Enter the batch it is coming. Let's go to transfer posting. Let me enter the batch row. I'm going to enter this batch. From MMB. Let me select the batch. 482. 482 batch. I'm going to transfer it. Now save it. I have created a batch and I have transferred the batch. Now, MMP, let's check MMP, slash in MMP. Let me delete everything and execute. Execute. 
CF batch. Now, two step procedure. I'm going to do two step procedure. I can use the same batch. I'm, I'm going to use the same batch for 483 and 482. Let's go to 303 batch. Skip this to the future pandemic. Enter material, plant MA03, storage location MA03, and SU01 here. SU01. Same batch. I'm going to select same batch. This is the batch. See here, or I'll select it from here. This batch. Quantity 10 quantity. And save it. Control S, save it, or click onto this post button. Now, stock and transit. It would be stock and transit. Let me refresh this. Transit stock, and I will receive it. See it. Stock and transit. Stock and transit. See it. It's in stock and transit. 10. Now I'm going to receive it in 305. Go to 305. Go to press enter. Material. Let me enter the material. This is the material. Plant. Receiving plant. SU01 is the receiving plant. Press enter. Let me select the batch here. Let me select the batch here. This is the batch. This is the batch. I'm going to select. Quantity 10 quantity. 10 quantity. Let me post this. Now let me go and refresh this. Go and refresh this and we see it. It's been received. In 20. 20 quantity has been received. This is so called stock and transit, or you can say replenishment, stock replenishment. Thank you.